County Sheriff's Office with your daily crime report. Happy Manic Monday to you. I hope you had a good weekend. Someone entered an unlocked vehicle parked at a home in the 13,000 block of Highway 441. They stole a purse that had $300 in cash in it. Then we had a 2007 Kawasaki dirt bike valued at $4,000. It was stolen from a home in the 1700 block of Northeast 167th Avenue. And then someone entered an unlocked vehicle while it was parked at a home in the 13,000 block of Southwest 40th Circle. And they stole a Garmin GPS valued at $100. Someone broke into a home in the 18,000 block of Southwest 75th Loop. Once inside, they stole a bicycle, generator, TVs, and various other items. Total loss there was approximately $5,000. Then Deputy Rodriguez responded to the 800 block of Northwest 56th Avenue reference to an altercation, made contact with Imero Jones, 26 years of age, who stated that two subjects just showed up at his home wanting to fight. He told the deputy that he stood in the doorway with a shotgun and the subjects left. Unfortunately, Mr. Jones is a convicted felon. He's not allowed to have guns, so he was arrested, the victim arrested for possession of a firearm and he was taken to the jail. We had two black males and a black female who broke into a home in the 16,000 block of South Highway 301 armed with a shotgun and a handgun. Once inside the home they grabbed the resident by the hair and threw him to the ground and they went through his home. They stole approximately $650 uh, and drove away in a silver four-door. I think there's more to that story. Hopefully we'll have more information for you on the crime report, maybe even later this week. Corporal Joseph was pulling into the Murphy Oil gas station on Cedar Radial Pass when the clerk suddenly ran out of the store stating that he was just robbed by a black male who was armed with a chrome-colored handgun. K-9 responded to track it was determined, though, that the suspect must have gotten into a vehicle, so that investigation is ongoing. Then while on patrol in the 5,000 block of West Highway 40, Deputy Bowers checked the vehicle, or clocked a vehicle, for going 62 miles an hour in a 50 mile an hour speed zone. Traffic stop was conducted, made contact with the driver, Gabrielle Trulender, 26 years of age, who had alcohol coming off of her breath. Uh, there was fresh damage to the vehicle and the bumper was hanging down. Miss Gabrielle stated that she did not know when or what she hit. It was discovered that her two-year-old son, though, was in the car also. He was sleeping. Deputy Moore responded, conducted a field sobriety test, which she failed and she was transported to the jail. Her son was given over to her mother, the grandmother, uh, to stay with her. And Miss Gabrielle blew a .148 and a .146 on the sobriety test. Hey, like us, share us, and have a great Manic Monday. I hope it gets better. We'll see you on Taco Tastic Tuesday. Thanks.